Hey guys, what's up? So today we're gonna learn how to do just a quick little game pass type thing. Um, so it's pretty simple. Uh, what do we have this dummy for? I have no idea. But we're actually gonna use this dummy anyways. So, well, first of all, we're gonna make a game pass. So to do that, just go over here to create and then go to your game and click create game pass. And once you're here, all you have to do is choose your name. So, well, first you want to choose your image. So we'll just choose. Mm -hmm. We'll choose this VIP and we'll just name it VIP. Gives you. VIP stuff. Obviously, you can change this to whatever you want, um, but for the sake of this, we're just going to do this. We're just going to have a little VIP game pass. Uh, so, what you want to do is actually click it, get this little ID here, and just copy it. And that's basically it. Uh, you pretty much made your game pass. Now, to actually make it work, um, Well, to make it work, we'll just do, this will just be called VIP, I guess, and we'll do game, actually we'll do local MS equals game get service, marketplace service, local VIP ID equals BAM. So now we have our Game Pass ID, and you can uh, really you can just keep putting these more like IDs, blah blah. But uh, for now, we're just gonna use this one, and we're just gonna do game dot players dot player added connect function player. And we don't want this to just run when the care or uh, when the player joins. We actually want it to fire every single time uh, the player respawns. So we're gonna do player dot character added home connect function character. So now basically every time a player respawns, um, this was gonna happen. This is some pretty basic scripting, but. Yeah, it's actually going to be really easy. So all you have to do is type if ms user owns game pass async player dot user id and then vip id or whatever your game pass id is. Um, yeah, sure, we'll disable that. Then, so if the player owns this game pass id. Then we're just going to do stuff. So anything you put in here will only happen if the player has this game pass. Uh, so basically, I'm just going to make a quick little uh, just like a, a VIP kind of title, I guess. And we'll put this. Two, eh, maybe three. Eh, it's kind of like right there. Maybe four. Yeah, four is good. We'll put it at four, and we'll just name this VIP. And insert. Actually, what we need to do is make the size instead of two hundred by fifty because uh, that makes it so when you so if we make th this 200 by 50, then as you can see, it's always going to be 200 by 50, no matter how close we are to it. But if we change the first number, which I'm pretty sure is the absolute size, um, then this will be like its actual size. So 
um, we can change this so we'll, maybe we'll make this four let's see how good that is yeah four is pretty good and three I guess nah not three we'll do one maybe yeah four and one that looks good so the closer you get further away you get and maybe we'll extend it up to five yeah that looks better okay and in the VIP we're just gonna put a text label and actually we're gonna make this where is it light influence I just saw it there it is make it zero max distance we'll just make it 200 just because um, it'll disappear actually we want it to disappear about the same time as its name so I think that's about 100 yeah 100 okay and as you can still see the text label is still trying to be the same size uh, so to fix that we'll just do the same thing we'll just make this one by zero by one by zero so that'll make it um, one so the full length of this and it'll also make it one the full height of this <clears throat> so now all we have to do is customize this to however we want it to look so we're gonna make the background transparency one uh, text size one okay back to two and back to one okay there we go uh, text stroke transparency zero I like my cartoon and we'll just name it VIP and the text color will have a cool little gold type thing so there you go this will pop up above the player's head well, not right now, but this that's what we're going to do. I kind of don't want it 5, maybe 4.5. That's better. Just kind of weird with uh, how this works. I don't know, it's just like kind of meh. But this is just a tutorial, so... We're not going to fix that or anything. Just kind of showing you how to do it. Uh, so now we're just going to put this in replicated storage. Let's have that VIP. Go back to the VIP and we'll do local RS equals game get service replicated storage. And we'll do local VIP equals RS. Wait for child. VIP colon clone. <clears throat> now, actually, we're gonna do character. Actually, we're gonna do local head equals character. Wait for child head and VIP. Oh, VIP dot Dorney equals head and VIP dot parent equals head. And that should be it. So just a really quick tutorial, 15 lines of just how to make a really quick uh, game pass. So if we actually click play, you can see we have the VIP above our head. And we're now a VIP. And of course, you know, nothing um nothing happens right now all we have is the title but yeah you pretty much get the gist if you want to add um like double xp or something then you would just put in the script uh where you get the xp just if user owns game pass async uh and then whatever the idea is for your double xp then you just make it give double the xp it's pretty simple so yeah hopefully you enjoy the tutorial and I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Peace out.